Hello and welcome to the labor productivity demonstration. The labor productivity application allows the user to see hospital staffing data for a healthcare network over an 18 month period. The application highlights key KPIs such as number of patients, overtime percentage, productive hours, and full-time employees per occupied bed. For this demonstration, we will take a look at how a regional nursing manager uses the labor productivity application. So let's get started. As the regional manager of the nursing department for a network of hospitals, I'm looking to identify any areas where we need to better utilize our employee hours. I go to the dashboard to find a high-level view of the nursing departments within our network of hospitals. I can filter to the nursing department by selecting nursing from the department list box. After selecting nursing from the department list box, I can see that the overtime trend for the nursing department is not looking good. For the week, month, and year view, I can see that we are above our target. I want to understand more about our overtime numbers, so I'm going to jump over to the overtime tab and see if I can identify any trends. On the overtime tab, I can read a scatter chart which helps me to identify a couple of metrics. The x-axis shows me the number of patients in each hospital. The y-axis shows the overtime rate for each hospital and the size of each bubble represents the number of full-time employees. Finally, the color of the bubble lets me know which hospitals are below our full-time employees per occupied bed target as shown in gray and which hospitals are above the target which are shown in red. One hospital has drawn my attention. The hospital has an overtime rate above our target of 4% and the red bubble indicates that the nursing department's full-time employees per occupied bed is above the target of 1.25. I want to take a closer look at this hospital, so I click on it. In the chart at the bottom of the page, we can see that nursing assistants incur both a high percentage of overtime as well as a high number of regular hours. I want to investigate this a little further, so I select Nursing Assistant from the chart. I'm curious now. How do house nursing assistants fare versus the nursing assistants in other hospitals? Let's take a look. By deselecting How in the hospital list box, I can now view all of the hospitals with the filter of Nursing Assistant. After deselecting How from the hospital list box, I can see that Howe Hospital is still one of the worst performers with a high overtime rate. Noting that, I now want to see are there any hospitals that are performing well in the nursing assistant area. I quickly see that there is such a hospital. The hospital is Grossmont Hospital located on the bottom right hand side of the chart. I want to compare these two hospitals so in the hospital list box I'm going to select Howe and Grossmont by holding down the control button and selecting the two hospitals. After narrowing down to the two hospitals, I want to hover over each hospital to see if I can find out more information. By hovering over How, I can see that they've handled 39,623 patients with 39 full-time employees and an overtime rate of 15.5% which is well above the 4% target. Now by hovering over Grossmont we can see that they have been able to handle 60,749 patients with 34 full-time employees with an overtime rate of 2.8% which is below the 4% target. The last thing that I need to find out is how has Howe Hospital done year to year with overtime. So I'm going to head over to the Cost Trends tab to take a look. Since I'm only interested in Howe Hospital's numbers, I'm going to select Howe Hospital from the Hospital List box to filter the data. Looking at the numbers for Howe Hospital, I can see that from January 2011 through June 2012, both the regular and overtime numbers have increased. With the new information that I have, I can now talk to the nursing manager at Hal Hospital and let him or her know about the trends and see how we can fix it. Preferably, we'll adopt some of the processes and procedures from Grossmont Hospital since they've been able to handle more patients with less overtime. 
So in conclusion, as the regional nursing manager for a network of hospitals, I wanted to see if there were any trends that I needed to identify within the department. On the dashboard, I identified the overtime trend for week, month, and year was above target. On the overtime tab, I was able to identify an outlier hospital, Howe Hospital, and see that they incurred a high overtime rate. I was also able to identify that nursing assistants had one of the highest overtime rates with the most regular hours. On the Cost Trends tab, I was able to see that Howe Hospital had increased both regular and overtime hours over the last 18 months. With only a couple clicks, I have a much clearer view of my department, and with daily access to the labor productivity application, I can now manage the department in a proactive manner and not in a reactive manner. This concludes the demo.